I made three quilt tops for my two great nephews and my great niece. They're all going to grow up together and they're all toddler age. So what I've done is, and I'll show you the other two quilt tops. I made the other two quilt tops first for the boys. What I've done is I made sure that each quilt has fabrics in it from each of the other two quilts because they're going to be growing up together. I wanted their quilts to be part of that. So I'm going to pan in a little bit closer. When I first was thinking about how I wanted to make this quilt, I thought I wanted to do a trip around the world quilt where these lines would be forming like a diamond pattern. When I start a project, I have an idea, but then once I get the blocks together and I start laying them out, the decision-making starts. And I decided that I like this layout best. Now I do not pre-draw any of my quilts. I go with my fabric stash and I pick my colors. It just sort of comes naturally as I sew. But I have an idea of what I want to do, what direction I want to go into. I'm trying to go a little bit slower for you. Okay, so this is for my great niece's quilt. Now let me show you the two boys' quilt. And as you can see, some of these fabrics are in Clara's quilt. This one is, this one is, I think it's those two. But the boys, I did strips in blues, blacks, grays. Okay, let me go get another boy's quilt. So, again, I did the bars pattern but I did a different configuration and I'll pan across. From here, obviously, you know what the next step is, sandwiching the quilts. This week I have a lot going on. So I'm hoping next weekend to get all three of these sandwiched so that I can start quilting. I actually think I know what I'm going to do. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to do utilitarian quilting all along the outside edge and across some of these long strips, very functional quilting, and then do ties in between. I think that's what I'm going to do. I haven't tied a quilt in a long time, and I've always enjoyed tying quilts. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe, so you can see the progress on these three quilts and my other postings. Have a great evening.